Hello friends, in this video I will show you how to read a text file from assets folder in Android Studio and display it in a text view. So here I have this simple app in which the activity main contains a scroll view for which the width and height is match parent and inside this there is a text view for which the ID is text view 1, width is match parent and height is match parent okay now in main activity.java I have used this ID text view one to define a text view now let's add an assets folder so for that we have to go to this app right click click on new and click on folder and here select assets folder and it should be in main folder click finish here this will create an assets folder now click on this assets right click new and here create a new file then name it name it as intro underscore text so now we have a text file intro underscore text now inside this i will add some text now we go to main activity dot java so here in on create we will get the text from this intro underscore text for that first we'll define a string variable my text is equal to empty then I will use this try catch exception e and in this try i will add i will define an input stream here i will write input stream in stream is equal to get assets dot open here we have to write the file name which is intro underscore text in next line i will define an int size is equal to in stream dot available next line i will define a byte array the b in byte should be in small case byte array buffer is equal to new byte array size In next line i will read from input stream in in stream dot read buffer and next i will get the text from this buffer so here i will write my text is equal to new string buffer and after this i will close the input stream in stream dot close so this is done and now my text is set to the text in the text file in assets folder and now we can display our text in text view so here i will write text view dot set text my text and that's all now if you 
want to be specific you can make it io exception this will be the type of exception and you can add a log here or you can show this message show this exception as message or you can leave it empty so here i will just leave it empty and now let's check this So here you can see the app and you can see that the text view contains the text which is there in the assets folder. So that's all in this video. This is the simple code which is required for reading text from assets folder. Thank you very much for watching this.